everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So we're still at Raffin right now, and I think what I want to try to do today, um, if we go to the command center, I want to try something a little tougher than we've been doing in the past little while. I'm going to go right to Heavy Lure here at the very bottom. It's uh, the government versus the government here, so we're going to be engaging a government lance in a Martian terrain. Extremely heavy mech battle, so we could be facing up to 9 mechs, 10 mechs maybe. Uh, at five skulls, but let's give this a shot with what we have. Um, I think, I don't, well, I don't know. Let's go this route. I don't know. I'm expecting to take a fair bit of damage, so I don't know. Let's go three of, th well, it, yeah. It's a chance to get some assault parts, so let's do this. And I could be walking into a huge uh, problem here but we're going to give it a shot let's bring saint in um, and i think we'll go this route now this is the um, mml lrm version which is um we're gonna have enough ammo i think we will and we've got the new loadout for the victor the ultra 5 the lbx uh, are we going to have enough? Oh, we got to fix the TSEMP cannon. So let's go back and do that real quick. Um, thought I fixed that. Maybe that thing gets damaged more often than not. Um, so where are you here? Um, this will be interesting to see what we can pull off here. So let's confirm this. It's three days, eh? Okay, well if it's going to be three days, we'll wait for Hellcat to come back and get her in. Let's have a look here. Um, so this is the MML9s, the PPC. So many turns of ammo firing we're going to have here. So we got 20, 35, mm, about 50 rounds. So it's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, um, about 12, 12 rounds of continuous LRM fire. Is 12 rounds going to be enough? Probably not. Um, uh, maybe we don't take this guy then. This guy's got Clan ER Large and four SRMs. So it's 10, 20. So this is 5, 10, 15 turns of continuous fire, plus the ability to melee half decent. Um, don't have an ECM on this guy. Hmm. So who else would we take here? Ah, oh, come on. There we go. Um. The Jager mech, I think, is just too light for this, and it's not carrying anywhere near enough ammo. Um, this guy is just doesn't have the firepower either. Not without a major refit. So I guess it is going to be the catapult then. Well, let's go with the Nodachi. Catapults. It's got the laser AMS clan version, though. Although that's not really going to help out. Um, this guy's got the Artemis and everything in him. Uh, Ryan obviously has to go. This guy's got the C3 Master, though. Huh. 
Hmm. It's got the warfare suite, the exchanger. Any way to get another ton in here? We don't have case two, do we? Do we have clan endo? We don't. We have endo composite. We don't have enough room to put anything in, really. Mm, do we have case two? Don't think we do. Okay, well, the only other thing we can do with this guy... If we pull out case and a half a ton of armor and keep this guy at a long range only. It's dangerous, but... That'll give us another ton. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen almost 15 turns. Okay, I think we're ready now. Gonna have to go through the financial statement. I'll let you know when that's done. Ready to go over financials whenever you are. Here we go. Alright, let's get um, Hellcat back. Uh, celebrate the Festival of Lights, because we could always use the plus one morale. Alright guys, let's do this. Oh, I'm nervous. This could end up being horrible. But we are going to go full salvage again. Really depends on the map we get here. Uh, I think we're going this route. Let's do it. Yeah, I know it probably will need more firepower than this, but let's see how we do. We're three and a half skulls. Command interface initiated. I got so nervous going into this, I forgot to load in Hellcat. Damn. I think we'll be okay, though. I think we'll be, uh, maybe okay. So how do we play this? We can either move straight in, tackle these guys. We know there's going to have be reinforcements up here. We could try to engage the reinforcements on this side first. And deal with these guys shooting down on them. Which will probably be... Standing by. The best way to go about this, I think. No shooting? Kind of nervous. Okay, I thought I heard a vehicle. It could be wrong, though. Full Hope we've got enough speed to pull this off. Don't know that we do, though. Waiting for orders. I love the spooky sounds in the Martian Where's environment. It's kind of cool. Yeah, well, we knew they were coming, Darius. Wield APC. Receiving you. Don't want to get too far ahead. Reporting enemy contact. Arbiter. Okay. Kind of good news. Roger, Skipper. Kicking it. 
25. 31. Not good enough for me. Okay, Jager mech. We may have gotten extremely lucky here. Kraken. Maybe not. See, every time I open my mouth, every time, I just gotta shut my mouth for crying out loud. Why do I do that? Uh, LRM 20. We got 12 turns of ammo here. So, that guy's not too bad. He's got rotary AC5s, though. Gotta kill that guy fast. Shadowhawk, okay. Hatomoto Kazi, eh? Kind of get the scope of the land here. I'm here. God, we got radiation and uh, rough terrain. We're not shooting yet, so I'll take the radiation and rough terrain. Cause why not? Hoping these guys split up a little bit. Once we crest this hill, this Mjolnir right now has got a couple turns to get into battle. us will lock you. Okay, there's another vehicle back here. King Scorpion. It's almost in strike range, that guy. monkey down here. Sorry, barbarian. Call it a monkey. Kind of looks like a, the gorilla. Uh, let's do this. Got a lock. You notice I got my logo in now. Had a little bit of extra time today, so I looked up how to do that. Kind of getting myself sandwiched here. What's up, boss? Let's get 
this started. This is the rotary guy. We got his arm. Let's take it. Whoa, what the hell? Why do we all of a sudden can't get uh, direct fire? That's right. kind of bizarre. Might as well do it first. Start off clean, firing. Huh. Okay, Rocky first. Amanda. Oh. Um. Reserve. What's up, buddy? Hmm. That better not have been a headshot. Oh. Christ. I'm Are you kidding me? Damage is light. Commander. Okay, let's see if we can take this guy's arm off. Or we can just kill him. That works. Enemy down. Location confirmed. Waiting for orders. Here it comes. I can't believe we took 60 to the head. Alright, let's see what they do.
Yep. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Reporting minimal damage. Standing by. Roger that. Mm. Waiting for orders. Okay, God, sorry I'm so quiet, guys. It's just I gotta really focus on what I'm doing here. This guy's gotta go. Um, not really much to say. It's just trying to like take out the biggest threats here and that's not one this Kraken will most likely be the next guy after the Orion he's probably gonna try and crest it oh he's not okay I maneuver myself into a really bad spot here Receiving you. Heading out. I mean, it's not, well, we can't get out of it, but I thought that uh, we would have enough speed, but we didn't, obviously, so. It's going down. I think I hit something good. Yo, Steve, back your ass up. All right, um, let's use that. Let's see what we can shoot here. Oh, we can shoot everything. Go for his head, maybe? Nah, it's all CT all the way here. Firing. Got what you deserve, buddy. God, he did a number on my back, I'll tell you. Okay, we're going to pull back and deal with these light guys. And then we'll use this hill and ridge to fight these guys. Ready for orders. Double time, let's go. Wow, it's really hot here, man. Being through the radiation doesn't help either. Oh, he's committing suicide. Fine with fine by me, man. Fine by me. So let's make our way out of here. Just gonna fire two. Okay, heavy firepower coming into the battle finally. Guy's still coming around to flank. Order. Most likely. I 
Let's just go with the lasers. That should really, I should handle it no problem. You can save a bit of ammo that way too. There we go. Okay, if we can cool down, as soon as that crack and crest the hill, we can hammer them hard. Ready for orders. No. Yes. Guys, only ten tons, man. We don't gotta do that much. Targeting for physical attack. There we go. Okay. Reporting. Now it's a four on four match. Eliminated. I know, I'm unstable. I know. Ninety four percent, though, guys. Let's try for a leg shot. Okay, two hits. I should have just shot straight out. Yes, Commander. Got it. Um, yep. Okay, he lost something. He's about to get a whole lot of LRMs. Nah. I'm very shy on exposing this mech now. To any kind of direct fire. Um... Yep, firing these guys. Reporting critical hit. Okay, I think overall heat management wise we're not doing too bad. Especially for a Martian environment. I'm glad we didn't face two two full assault lances though, we would have been in a big a lot of trouble. If it wasn't this terrain, like if it was like, I don't know, like if we had like a water terrain, like a lowlands or something, it would be a, it would be hugely different. Okay, we can fire two, and we'll dump them both in this guy. Oh, he's gone down. Nice. Standing by. Uh, let's get... This guy's not doing anything, but let's... Um, not worry about him. <laughs> Focus on what the main problem is. Try for the headshot. I'm going to go with the snub nose and fire. Pretty soon he'll be in stepping range, or visual range, so enough for me to step on him. So I don't think this guy can see us back here. That guy can, though. Okay, it's the laser hawk. Ooh, tag. Screw you, buddy.
Ah, might as well spread it around. Commander. Got it. Okay, there we go. Tango down. Stand in by. Let's make sure that Shadowhawk can't see us. And we're gonna save a little bit of heat on this one. Drop some missiles on this guy. A couple points, nah. What's up, Bubba? Roger. Nice. Cooling is impaired. Look at the laser hawk, man. It's crazy. Surprise is not overheating yet. Light damage. Holding firm. Like, look at that. Proto heat sinks, maybe? Gotta walk this. Gonna turn my left side. Uh, make, yeah, I gotta make sure my back can't be seen by the vehicle. Let's confirm the Warlord. Let's let him eat some PPC. Nice lasers. Should try getting some PPCs, man. Waiting for orders. See if we can knock his ass to the ground here. Critical hit, Commander. Receiving you. Position confirmed. Don't need a warlord on this one, but I'm going to. I want a better chance to hit. I'm going to go for the CT and hopefully finish him off. You don't got the juice to play that game, buddy. Maybe you've a shot. That's it. He just committed suicide, pretty much, that guy. Okay. I should have had my ass killed in this match. Um, but we managed to pull it off. Don't need the T-Samp on this one. That's a kill. Yeah, we got four. I'll uh, leave this guy off and fire the rest. There it is, folks. Crawler destroyed. Mission successful. Was it really? Okay, that was a horrible mistake my, on my part. It's going to cost us more than two hundred fifty thousand. Don't think we took any major crits, though. The one bonus thing I gotta say about taking that one, the uh, tactic skill um, or tactician is that minus 50% critical hits. 
It's huge. It's a huge deal. You're, I really notice it, that's for sure. All right, what is there here that we want? These medium lasers, maybe rotary 5. Do we have any in stock? We don't have any in stock. Ultra 5. We'd rather have the clan versions. This AMS is actually really nice. It's four tons though, weight wise, but still DNI cockpit. We need this because we have that. Uh, we have a cockpit mod that the virtual reality cockpit. And I think I want to try that out. So let's take that. Bloodhound probe is actually really good. Sensor and sight range. But who do we put it on? I guess the Mjolnir maybe. Take something off to put it on there. I think. Um, spiked leg boots. TSMs, double load of LRM ammo. Um, 200, that's an extra 30 rounds, but I don't know. Geez, what do we take here? Bloodhound probe, probably. I mean, we've got a clan rack 5, so we don't need this one. Let's take the Bloodhound probe. I haven't really got into any probes yet, so let's take this and see. Uh, I mean, let's just see how it does. Okay, Arbiter part, Hadamoto Kazi, Kraken, Kraken, nice, LRM20. We got only got one of those bonus medium lasers. And that's about it. All right. So, not too bad. Some, oh, 77,000. Okay, that's not too bad at all. So there's a five skull mission, not too bad. I mean, we got lucky on the draw on that, that's for sure. So let's do another one real quick here. What do we else we got here on this planet? Um, hostile insertion, outworld dropship, three skulls. Let's negotiate this and let's go to a 10. Enough money to get our uh, financial report and a little bit left over. And let's pull out these guys. So we're going to bring in the this guy. Um, let's go with the Jager mech. And the two catapults, maybe? Sure, why not? Um, so let's bring in... Wait a minute, did we switch to... We did have Hellcat in the last mission. What the hell was I thinking? Okay, Squire should be in the node... No, we want to get Tugboat in the node. No, who is it now? Kerberos. So let's put the Nodachi down here. Let's bring the Jager mech up to number one. And let's drop in uh, Squire number one. Um, this is the A1 missile version. So let's go with just Jazz. And let's go with this. Uh, where are you here? Tugboat goes into the second catapult. Because you'll be in a direct line of fire with the PPC. You can move out of the way if you have to. Then Kerberos with the melee on the Nodachi. So let's deploy and see what we can do here. Alright, Heavy Lance versus Heavy Lance. Ah, the mercenary life. Problem two. Where are we again? <laughs> Yeah, we're in hell, Bubba. We're in hell. Um, let's go this way. I'm not really familiar with this map that much. Let's move along this way. We should be able to go up through here. Okay, they're moving down there. Standing by. I don't know. Do we want to go this route? On my way. I think with the Nodachi we do. 
Squire will head down there too, and we'll send Jazz. We'll send the two catapults up this way. Good to, go. to get the height advantage. And then we'll move the, uh, the Nodachi and the uh, Jagermech straight yeah. down here. Okay. Jagermech will provide, provides uh, fire support for the Nodachi. Bushwhacker, that guy's got to die. Marauder, cool. Barbarian, Thunderbolt. So this guy's got to die first, then this guy. Well, it depends. If this guy's going to get into melee range, then he's got to die. The Bushwhacker, we can overheat. We know we can do that with the Jagger mech. It's the anti Bushwhacker mech. What can I do, you fool? This is in strike range of that uh, barbarian, but who says we need to move up? I've got eyes on hostile of course you do. They're heading your way. Okay, we got to kill these guys fast then. Everything on this guy. Kill this bushwhacker. I don't think we'll think we hit the tag at all. Okay, raptor and a raven. Good to go. We're just gonna walk it in. Mm, not bad with the SRMs. And can I watch my ammo? Tugboat's gonna smoke this guy, I hope. Okay, let's finish this guy up, please. Okay, he's going down, which means we go before him next turn. Enforcer, okay. Large laser and uh, AC-10. I think this barbarian's got to go next. He's just skirting on the edge of sensors. Go through the torso. Maybe that's enough. Okay. Right, he's got the ultralight. Or, yeah, the XL. That's the ra that's the uh, Raven, right? Yeah, Raven 2. PBC's got a bad chance to hit, so we'll just fire the MMLs. It's enough to get started. Don't think he's going to be that hot. Got to move in to spot him. K. 
Okay, 65 heat's not bad. Want the extra 5% to hit. Let's attack him from this side. I don't want to turn my back the other way because that's where the Marauder is. Marauder's over here. If it's got two PPCs, it could have back, back shot us for sure. Wow, you're kind of small. You're suiciding, dude. Really? Okay, who's doing what here? Shoot. Okay, he's firing. Bonus, that's really good to know. I mean, it's not good because we're taking a lot of damage, but might be able to shut him down here. Shut him down, shut him, shut him down. Okay, what's the other guy over here? So this episode has actually turned out pretty good. I, I actually having a lot of fun. Ah, crap. Fucking T-Simps. He says... Oh, f yeah, might as well be an Arrhenia, eh? Might as just freaking well be an Arrhenia. Come on, let's get lucky. Nope. That leg's taking a lot of damage, though. Not enough. This guy's got crap tons of armor. Jesus, what are you doing? It's become brawl bots, guys. That shot got past my armor. Yes, come in. Moving to position. Uh huh. If it keeps going like this, we're going to have to pull out of here. The Marauder really even hasn't engaged yet. Looks like we go before the Barbarian. Nope, we don't. Ready for orders. You got it.
Okay, let's go this route. Okay. That helps things. Of course. I'm generating a lot of heat, Commander. Ready for order. Sure. Okay, he's tagged. Damn T-Semps, man. I'm telling you. Where are you going? Waiting for orders. Okay. It's not a lot, but it's something. Uh, it's a different loadout for that guy. God damn it. Not bad, not bad. Scored at critical hit. We're taking a pound in here. That sounds like he shut down. It disappeared. Christ. Oh boy. That's bad. Losing initiative too is like it's horrible. I was hoping to kill him. I was hoping to kill that guy. Means we gotta spend a couple of turns shooting at him still. Or a couple of mechs shooting at him. Yeah. They're loving you, buddy. They're just loving you. Good to go. <sighs> I just don't think we got the juice to finish this. 
See what we can do to this guy. Just don't have the firepower. Uh, I'm gonna re I'm gonna withdraw. There's no point in wasting good mechs or pilots. Yeah, we'll take the loss on this one. Damn. Retreat. Let's get out of here. It's just a loadout. It's just we just didn't have the firepower. There's just no way. All right. Um, well, we still got something anyway. Pirate Rotary Two. LBX Ten. Got one of these already, though. See, that was a mission where the overheat didn't help us at all in that Jaeger mech. Already got one of these. We've got endo steel. Got ECMs. Do we have any double heat sink kits kicking around? We do. Part of heat sinks. Got two of these. There's no case two. How much is this worth? 1.4 mil. Let's grab it. So three bushwhacker parts, okay. And an ECM. Yeah, not much we could do about that. 185,000. We got stuff to sell, so we're all right. It's just a time for repairs, more than anything. Yeah, we got some time before the end of the month too, so we're not worried. Uh, let's swap around. Let's get our main lance up here. Uh, this catapult. And the Orion. Wow, one of our catapults didn't take any damage. 22 days for the Jagger. Yeah. So here's my thought on that. So our catapults just they're not set up for this fight. Um, the LRMs are okay, but only one mech with LRMs in a supporting role on a heavy fight like that. The other thing is the Jagger mech, while it's putting out heat to overheat enemies, um, it just doesn't have any other firepower to just, like in the heavy category, heavy and assault categories, to do a lot of damage to anything. And the no dachi I'm finding, it's it doesn't know what it wants to be, right? It could be a missile platform. It does okay damage. Then if you try and melee, it does okay damage, right? It's not really a melee mech, and it's not really a missile platform. It's not really... It's just a roundabout mech, so I don't know. Um, that second lance is lacking a lot of firepower, especially in the heavier range. Like if we were, if that was a one and a half, or sorry, two and a half skull, or two skull mission, we'd be no problems. But it just, I mean, our main lance would have just chewed through those guys. So we got to figure out what we're doing firepower wise for that second lance. Um, not going to worry about it right now. Um, I'll probably sell stuff between episodes and get our main lance back up and running for the next episode and see what we can do at that point. But until then, I'm going to leave it. Uh, if you guys got any suggestions for that second lance loadout, drop them in the comments section down below. I know uh, a few people talked about maybe doing like um, overheating and um, going with like plasma cannons and stuff. I don't know. I don't, I'm just not convinced. The Like the Jager mech... It's one of those tricky mechs. It really doesn't... Like, I mean, the, the Jager mech that we faced before with the pair of Rotary Autocannon 5s is not a bad loadout. But it's slow, especially if you want it to have be fully armored. Um, and it's all splash 40 damage. So, I, I mean, I don't know. We'll have to see what we can pick up equipment-wise. And I'll, I'll look at some different uh, loadouts. Especially for the catapults. 
Um, I mean, we could put a bigger engine in and just go all SRMs, but the problem is, is there's only a certain number of hard points on most of them, right? The main catapults um, just got two LRM hard points in each each arm. So, like the uh, A1, that is. Some of the other ones have got energy hard points in the torso, but mm, I don't know. Anyway, we'll leave it there. Uh, if you like the episode, drop a like. Drop your comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.